Uh, there's no mirror, so I have no idea how this is going to look, but <laughs> let's see after. Yeah, guys, so you can see I'm just getting my hair cut just on a random street here under a bridge. 13 years, you stay here? Sector 7, yeah. Good morning. I'm in Sifang, a district here in Qingdao. And today, I need to go get a haircut because my hair is getting quite long. And I found some ladies here on the street who cut hair. So let's go and get our haircut and see what a street haircut is like in China. Oh, no one's here. Where's she gone? Okay, there's a lady over here who just cuts hair. Uh, ni hao, uh, li fa? Li fa, ha? Let's have a look. So it's just on a little chair here. Uh, she's got a sponge, things like this. So yeah, usually when I get a haircut, just show like a... Do this, something like that. Yeah, huh? yeah, so as you can see, she's got the clippers and a, and a hair comb. Huh. I don't know if she, if she uh, knows how to do a fade, but yeah, let's see how this turns out. Uh, how, how long have you been cutting hair? Wow. Why do you cut hair here? So yeah, right now I'm literally getting my hair cut in the middle of a road. Uh, how many people's hair do you do you cut a day? Wow, so 30 people. They stay here whole day. What time do you start? Eight in the morning. Wow. We finish at four. Wow. Wow. You, you, you work very hard. Wow. So now she's cutting the side of my hair with the with the razor and a, a comb. Uh, there's no mirror, so I have no idea how this is going to look. But <laughs> let's see after. And the people who cut hair, all the other hairdressers, you work together. Oh, so you just come here by yourself? Okay. Nice, nice. Wow. No difference with the 100, 300 hair cut. Do you get many uh, foreigners coming here to cut hair? Yeah, you have a in the Yes. So? Not that many. Where are you from? What are you from? Are you from Qingdao? No. Oh, Sichuan. Why did you come to Qingdao? Oh, okay, you have children? Oh, wow.
think you might need some water. <laughs> Shui ma? Oh, I got to put. I don't know how it's looking, but it feels short on the sides. Oh, she's. Yeah, I put some hair wax in, so she's gone to fetch something. Get some water. And a bag of goodies. Oh, now it's way. Okay. That's alcohol. <laughs> Yeah guys, so you can see I'm just getting my hair cut just on a random street here under a bridge. Yeah, now she's using the scissors to uh, just trim the back, I guess. But yeah, there's no mirror, so I don't know like how this is looking. She's just getting the kitchen scissors out. Just going at it. But yeah, these people work really hard. She said she's here from 8 in the morning till 4. But it's good that she's under a bridge, so I guess if it's raining, then she'll have no problem to cut hair. You always cut hair here? Is that 13 years? You stay here? This location like seven, eight years. Wow, so this lady here has been cutting hair for... It's under this break. Wow, so yeah guys, she's been cutting hair for eight years. So if you're ever in Sifang, in Qingdao, find her. Your name is Minza. Zhu Shifu. So yeah guys, if you come here, ask for Zhu Shifu. And she'll cut your hair. <laughs> What's it like working here every day? Do you meet some interesting people? Mainly, uh, so what kind of people? Uh, so many different kind of people out there. Okay. Yeah. You, when you cut hair here, it's mainly old people, or do you get some young people as well? Most of the old people, they went to the, the market, the morning market. Okay, so there's a market, yeah. just right yeah. over there. They don't mind you cutting hair here in the streets? No one bothers you? The police or something? No, no one. Sometimes the officer will come, but they don't bother her. Oh, do you need like a license or something to cut hair here? Or anyone can do it? Yeah, guys, so a lot of people think China is like a communist country. You have people like her. Hustling on the street cutting hair. Yeah, yeah. Hey. 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 Oh, right. <laughs> For the rivals. Oh, so digging into my into my neck with the razor. She said she stayed here so many years. Bye bye. And the new new hairdresser come here. They have no business. Wow. So yeah. So yeah, we're we're in her spot. This is like a local spot then. Wow. Yeah, she's done a good job. 
got the sides, a bit off the top. Oh. It's just here. Oh, I'm covered in hair. There's your mirror. Oh. All right, perfect. All right, guys, what do you guys think? Bit off the top, bit off the side, that'll do. Okay, um, Dolchen, Jiga? Dolchen, Li Fan Ma. Shukwai, okay. Shukwai. Okay. Wishing. Hey guys, I gave it 80 because that's how much I usually pay for a haircut. So, oh, she's here, give it a basher. Make sure. Oh. Yeah, make sure, make sure. <laughs> yeah, well, make sure, make sure. Oh, she's here, she's here. All right, guys, so yeah. Street haircut in China. Let's have a look from the side. Yeah, so now she's cutting someone else's hair, but this whole little spot is just where people come and cut hair. And yeah, they don't really need like a license or anything to come and cut hair here. They just set up and yeah, start cutting hair. So she's been here for 14 years. So that's really impressive. And you can see behind me, people are just playing cards, playing like checkers and stuff. So this is where old people tend to come and hang out. But she said she'll cut around 30 people's hair a day. And that haircut just came to just over a dollar, just 10 RMB. And yeah, I can imagine she does fairly well cutting hair there, but yeah, I thought I'd help her out a little bit. I mean, I usually pay around I don't know, $10, um, 80, 80 to 100 RMB for a haircut. So yeah, hopefully that will help her out for the day, cutting hair. But yeah, you can see in China, people are just grafting. Got their, they're hustling for money, even if it's like cutting hair or something like this. And yeah, I think she did quite a good job. I mean, got, the, got a fade <laughs> with her scissors and her razor. But street haircutting in China. Next time, let's see what else we can, we can find. I know they do like eye massages and ear massages here. So that's something we can try. But yeah, if you like the video guys, make sure to like it and yeah, stick around for more.